Welcome back, my name is Benji. Today I want to welcome you to Strada Bianca 2021. Finally it's here. I love this race, I genuinely do, and last year on PCM we did this one as well with Jumbo Visma and it was genuinely one of the best races I've ridden ever on Pro Cycling Manager. So let's see if we can do that again, let's see if we can bring this home with the team that you chose for me. Stylist wise, absolutely golden. We start with Alaphilippe at the Koenig, Van der Poel at Alpecin, Van Aert at Jumbo Visma, Pogacar at UAE, Formula at UAE, second last year if I recall correctly. The Stana here as well with Fulsang. We also have the likes of Kwiatkowski, Bernal and Sivakov at Ineos, Volvari at Movistar, but don't expect too much there. Bilbao, Mohoric, we have Van Avema, yeah. List just keeps on going and perhaps one of the outsiders to me is also Molema because he's been in a golden form this February. We are going to be selecting Alpecin Phoenix. And Matthew Vanderpool is obviously leader of that team as well. I believe we've got some decent helpers in the team but it ain't going to be amazing because I don't think the likes of Jonas Ricard is going to stay in that peloton group until the last 30 kilometers. We're most likely having to depend on Murice, Vakoc and Vermeers here even though Vermeers is also kind of difficult on that aspect of things. Nonetheless, very much looking forward to diving into this. I'll see if I can get someone in the breakaway because that could really play into our cards here. I'm going to try and wait until it starts going uphill here and then I'll launch Vermeer to the breakaway of 12 who's being countered by Chris Harper at the moment. This is the moment I want to attack. Come on Harper, don't block us. On to the attack and that's an easy bridge if the green car goes up. We're driving a car, we're cheating. Anyway, we're in the group. 13 people, that's good, and it didn't actually spend us too much energy because we chose to attack at the foot of the climb and not on the flat section, which often helps on PCM, by the way, if you don't know that. So the break is off. Brambila, Jul Jensen, we've got Ledanois, Peag, Van Asbroek, Kron, Gamper, Serrano, Renard, Conchi, Gombo, Bakelans, and myself with Vermeer. So... Pretty solid breakaway to be honest, pretty typical breakaway riders. Oh, we have a move in the peloton and I'm not prepared for this. Simon Clark, Pitcock, Daniel Oz, Loic Vliegen, Stannard, that is Rob Stannard, Kevin Ginietz, Joris Nieuwenhuis, Hugo Ull, we've got Alex Anamburu, Bauke Mollema and Michael Goggle. That's a hell of an attack. I didn't see that coming. I'm trying to keep myself up here with like everybody. I should protect Vakoj though, like... He's good enough to do so. Murray's as well. And that way we've got our three better riders in the boat. Oh, that's a crash. Gone balls down. Oh, come on. They just blocked everybody on the sandy road. But we're off again. I think those crash riders were part of the breakaway because I swear we were with 13. And it looks like a portion of that second group is also dying out, it seems, because there's only six people left of this group. Molema actually not at the back, which is surprising. He's got to do a lot of work. Oh, he's done. Really? That's how it's done? That's how Molema's over? He attacks with 70k to go and he's done? That says a lot about his upcoming race. I think we're looking good then. All in all. We're on one of the hardest sections because it's a climbing section. That's the Monte Santa Marie. Usually people try to attack or at least move themselves up and break the peloton in doing so. So... That's exactly what I'm trying. Vakoc actually looking... Oh, we're getting blocked on the left side of the road there. But we're looking fine. I think I'm going to put Vakoc in between there as well. Frijardo looking great for the uh, stats he has. Asgren with the attack. Mohoric following. We've got Van Aert doing so as well. Let's try and counter that with Otto Frijardo. That's... Yeah, that's a sentence. I'm going to counter Van Aert with Otto Frijardo. That's actually happening. Murice, you're going to try and do your own tempo. What am I doing? Oh, this is bad. No, 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 no. I'm going to... Can I stick themselves in that group? And then perhaps try and bridge up with Muris uh, with Van der Poel in his wheel? That would be ideal. A lot of Philippe still here as well. But he won't pay us because Osgrain's in that front group. But I think we're about to catch this group again pretty soon with Muris. So I'm not too worried. Ballerini pacing now. So I'm actually just going to sit up for now. I think that the Koenig is going to take care of this for me. The fact that Otto Vergaard is doing so great in our team is just a bit of a joke, isn't it? <laughs> oh my god. Positioning is not great at the moment. We're not in the group that I hoped to be in. Wout van Aert with an attack and I'm not ready at all. I think that he's gonna bridge up towards the team. Nope, where is he? Oh, he's attacking over here. Everybody's following. Except for me. Oh no, 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 no. Otto, protect. 
Murdisa, and now Murdisa can keep on pacing. Everybody's just going for it right now. Like, what are you doing? Just when we are back in this group, Valvade decides to attack and Wellens as well, but 27 people here are in the group of Outfanat, so I'm not worried at all. I think we're looking for... Oh, we're not in the group of Fanat anymore. We are not in the group of Fanat anymore. Can we move up? I think I need to use you. Then Vergaard in the wheel. Come on, Vakarj, get to the front and stop being blocked. And everybody's back. Okay. Murisa, bring yourself to the wheel of Johnny Vermeers. Or can I switch that around? I think I'll do it like this. Anyway, the race is back together. 37 kilometers to go. 37 people at the front. That's basically poetry. Greg van Avermaet. We're going to try and set the tempo like mad with Vermeers right now to try and follow this attack by Wout van Aert and such. And are we able to follow this? I think we kind of are. We have domestiques while these others don't. So everything's looking pretty great for us, to be honest. Vermeers, Murice and Van der Poel. That's our team at the moment. The rest is basically done for at the moment. So uh, goodbye, Vakarj. Goodbye, Vergaarde. Let's keep it up with these three. And another attack by Volvare. The rest is following. Looks like there's no offense just after the attack of Volvare. So let's try and follow the tempo for now. 11 kilometers. Oh, let's go ham again. This is another attack. Come on, Vermeers. You can do it. 11 kilometers. Murdis in the wheel. We're spending a lot of energy here. That's a gap. That's a gap. Kwiatkowski, man. What have you done? Kwiatkowski. No. No, 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 no. Let's keep pacing. Let's close this down. Vermeers. Van Aert is gone together with Van Avermaet. Nine kilometers. Come on, come on, come on. Murdis, it's your turn. Let's close that down. Let us close that down in this descent. We need to. Eight kilometers. Come on, man. Let's do this. Let's do this. Let's do this. We can't let them go right now. We can't let them go. Keep on pacing. Fanard with another attack. Dropping Van Avermaet off the wheel, I think. We're going to try and hammer it with Murdis on top here to try and counter that. 20 seconds to their wheel. Oh, this is bad. I think Fanard has it. Let's hope not. But I think Fanard has it. Let's 99 on this climb again. Then it's descent. So we might as well try and use Murdisa to the fullest on this section. There we go. I'm going to switch to Van der Poel. And I'm going to protect Murdisa as we speak. 29 seconds. Ala Philippe in the wheel. Can we work together with this man? Come on, dudes. Help us. Three people. Why is nobody helping me? Three kilometers. Energy shell. We got to hammer it. We got to hammer it. 85. I think Van Aert has it. I think Van Aert has it. Let's try and counter it. Let's try and counter it. I'm going to go 90 as we speak. 95. 93. I don't want to go too much. I don't want to go too much. I don't want to go too much. 800 meters. 800 meters. Let's go 99. Let's go first into the corner. Van der Poel passes the rest. Van der Poel passes the rest. Is he going to win? I celebrated too early. No, I did not. Yes, we win. We take home Strade Bianche right at the finish. On the last climb, we beat Van Aert. With our acceleration on the uphill. Ala Philippe comes in second. Wout van Aert in third. And Greg van Avermaet on fourth position. I really thought we lost it. I generally thought we lost it. But we came around in the last section. We brought home Strade Bianche 2021. Fraps and Phoenix here. Honestly, putting Vermeer in the breakaway might be the reason that we win this race. Because without him, I don't think we would have been able to catch van Aert or van Avermaet on that last climb. So shout out to Johnny Vermeer. It really seems to work on this parkour to put people in the breakaway. And if you've got a strong enough rider, like we had with Yumbo last year, then you can move mountains because uh, if you have not seen last year's edition of My Strada Bianca on PCM, then definitely check it out because it's, it's, it's a wonderful race. Anyway, if you liked today's episode, tap that like button. If you didn't tell me what's wrong, I'll try and make it better for you next time. Thanks for watching and I'll see you soon. Goodbye.